Yeah, hello, Miss Prospect. Is this a good? Is this a bad time? Can I have a minute of your time? Um, how's your day going? You're not busy, are you? Can I have a moment of your time? Could I stop by on Friday at 10:30? I have some great information for you. Are these the things you're saying on the phone? Because you're shooting yourself in the foot before you ever get started. I know when I get a phone call and someone who I don't know, someone who's interrupted my day and called me up and they say, are you busy right now? Or can I have a moment of your time? What does that say to you? What does it say to me? It says that they're trying to sell me something. They're an uninvited guest. They're intruding in my day. Don't start off on the wrong foot right away because people will immediately make a judgment on you. They'll say, oh my God, Harriet, this is a salesperson calling. I'll never get off the phone. I want to get off the phone. I'll hang up on them. I'll say, take me off your list. You've got to have, you've got to start your phone calls in a much better way. Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, did you hear what happened? Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, you have a problem. Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, I have your number in front of me. Um, I'm, I'm sorry it took me so long to get back to you. How can I help you today? Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, I have a surprise to tell you. Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, did you hear what happened in your neighborhood about real estate in your, in, right near your building? These are ways to ask questions. What you want to do is ask a question that stimulates an emotional response that gets you into what we call an adult-to-adult -adult dialogue so that you can have a conversation with people. So guess what? The more people we speak to, the better chance we have of doing a deal, getting the information we have, persuading them, influencing them, getting their EQ up, emotional quotient, because people make immediate business decisions emotionally. How do you do that? With facts and figures, sizzle and steak, uh, features and benefits, or do you ask questions that paints a picture in their mind? You actually can control the environment with a prospect, have great conversations. You can both laugh, have fun. You're not gonna sell everybody, but if it's not fun on the way to the bank, you're doomed to fail because who wants to pick up that cactus all day long and get rejected? You've gotta to learn to ask the right questions up front. Otherwise, you're just gonna get rejected all day long, and if you're a sensitive guy like me who cries at Disney movies, you're not gonna to wanna to keep doing, staying in this business and be successful. It's so easy to fix. Just make these right, just say the right thing at the right time and you will see magic happen. But don't go on the phone and say, do you have just a minute of your time? Because they will say no and they will reject you a lot. Hey, listen, you guys, nobody deserves success more than you. I answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. Uh, give me a thumbs up or go to my webpage, claudediamond.com, get a free book or get a free mentoring session, okay? Take care.